So each of these faces, one, two, three, and four. And so you have to expose it to the entity maker and then expose it to FX creator. I've noticed a lot of people people have been having problems with this, which I had as well. But hopefully this will help. So what we're gonna do now, we'll click the facial action mode which is right here. Click on one face, two, three, and the fourth one. Remember I'm only doing these four so I can make this tutorial as simple as possible. And now what we're gonna do, we're gonna press U and we're gonna do um no 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 wrong one control E sorry and then we're gonna do max scene basically what will happen here if I press A you can see that these edges have been highlighted in red and now what we're gonna do go to at the top here where you have your screen layout I'm gonna go to UV editing remember guys UV editing let's make this smaller now what we're gonna do is select your faces again w one two no oh. one two no nope. two three and four no nope. wrong one sorry computers now what you're gonna do now you press u and then you go to unwrap which now comes here now it's simple here yeah. what we're gonna do we have to create a new image so you click new click ok you're gonna see that now you, you'll be able to see it properly next thing simple image open image go to where you have your saved picture i have in here blender save psc and i've clicked the football and i have the teams here so what you can do now you can select your face is if you show your face is you can place whatever you want so I'm gonna, I'm gonna just line it up properly you click on basically you just click on the corners and just place it wherever you want to place and remember it's only four here yeah now we've done this what we're gonna do now next step is simple go back into the default mode see if you render it it doesn't show up see with blender you have to create a texture first you have to put a new material in there assign a quick texture you have to open the texture which has your image remember when you go to texture you have to change the type to image or movie go to open Go to where you have your image images, which is here, football, and it will show up here. Remember, guys, you have to change the coordinates to UV. When you change the coordinates to UV, it will, be, it will show. But first, if you want to see how your texture looks like, you see where you have edit mode here. You just click it and go to texture paint, and you can rotate it and see it properly how it will look. Now we go to default ed I mean edit mode. Go back to the UV editing so we can save your picture. Go image, which is right at the bottom here. Save a save as image, and you can save it as one two three dot jpg. Save it into the same folder, by the way. Save as image, and now go back to your default scene. And now it's time to export this. We export this as dot x, which is right here. If you go to export, you see it. Export x one two three dot x. Save it in the same folder that you have your picture. Export. And now we go to Entity Maker, which is hey guys, welcome back to my tutorial. Now what we're, gonna do, what we're gonna do now is quite simple, we'll just load our file into the Entity Workshop, add the simple texture that we have on it, which is the image that we have saved in the same folder, and then put it on FPSC. So what we do, we go to your Entity Import, which is right here, look for your file, and mine is 
in here then one two three if i rotate you can see it's right there a bit small but it doesn't matter just scale it up a bit yeah okay now we're gonna add the texture on it click your i call this the paint go desk desktop where, where i have mine in here one two three and you can see that it's here and now you just save it uh top four thing top four things box collision and that's it now we go to fs creator Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you for checking my last tutorials. And remember also, once you open the FS Creator, you open your project, and once you go to MTPs, it should be on your workshop um, area. And once you click and you put on your project, you can come to FS Creator, and you will see right there. And these are the three which I've put up. One, two, three. And see it has the textures on each side. Remember, this is a simple tutorial, but this should get you on your way to creating your models and be able to put them into FPS Creator. Thank you very much. Visit fpsegames.co.uk. Interviews, movies, and more features coming very soon. We will also be releasing some model packs for free, which you'll be able to use for your games. And thank you very much.